So today I'm gonna tell you about what I had for breakfast. Yeah, welcome back. Thanks for coming back. We're gonna we're gonna get. Hey, hey, stop, Ralph. Ralphie, no, no. What are you doing, you big crazy? All right, I'm gonna tell you what I had for breakfast today. For breakfast, I had scrambled eggs mixed with potatoes mixed with Tabasco hot sauce mixed with ketchup now the thing about ketchup and the thing that I don't like about ketchup is when ketchup is like absurdly cold Ooh, we got TM 30 you know like an absurdly cold ketchup because in the army we never had like oh double kick we never had like any terribly cold ketchup and I got used to it and then I come home and it's like all the goddamn ketchup is in the fridge and I can't eat it so one day I left the ketchup out and my mom yes I still live with my parents have no shame and my mother put it back in the fridge and now it's absurdly cold again and it makes me sad truly does. Anyways, welcome back to Pokemon. We are blazing through Pokemon Blue, and we are at Cerulean City, rocking with the same lineup as before, so no need to do a team recap. Um, let's see, there's the gym, there's the Mart, and we managed to get through Mount Moon. So, and I see, oh, they do have repels. Hell yeah. What, I got $3,000? Oh, fuck. Okay, never mind. I need potions. I need potions more than anything right now. Thanks, buddy. And give me an awakening. Give me... Oh, wait, no, no, no. I can sell stuff. Like that max revive? That's like... Cheddar, bro. That's pure cheddar. Now, give me some repels, because I don't want to be running in anything in the wild. Give me like six. That will significantly cut our time for episodes. So today, um... What's going on? We're in Cerulean City. Uh, I don't think Misty's at the gym because she's off with, like, Bill or something. Like, let's see here. Or can we just, can we just get in there? Is she here? Oh, look at that. Well, we're not gonna battle her yet because I feel like we are under- <coughs> well, I feel like we are under-leveled. So we are gonna go on the Nugget Bridge. Let's see here. What's in here? What up, old man? Pokemon badges are owned by skilled trainers. You have at least one. What? They have secrets? <laughs> uh, okay. I'm on. I would ask him. But, like, then again, I'm not that curious about it. Because it's- Oh! Sweet Jesus, it's dicks. Are you doing great? Hmm. Alright. Didn't see this coming. Pidgeotto? Doesn't he actually have a Pidgeotto? Level 18? Boy, if you don't... No! Ah. Oh my goodness. See, the smart thing would be to do is to change to Buzz Lightyear. Because Buzz Lightyear could, like, one-shot the Pidgeotto. Uh, oh, perfect. Buzz, 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 buzz Lightyear. This is why you joined our party. 
I'm pretty sure you can take down Gyarados. It's a four times weakness for crying out loud. And he outspeeds. Okay. As long as he doesn't get like a quad crit right here. As long as he doesn't miss. Oh yeah, Buzz. He's gonna get, he's gonna get like a thousand. And there's 600. All right, uh, Weedle. Weedle, we don't deal with those. Uh, I'm tired of these worm Pokemon. Like, give me a cool bug type Pokemon. I want to have like a like a beetle, like a scarab beetle. That's not Heracross because one Heracross is perfect and can't do anything wrong, and I love him more than. Like, he's, he's like threatening to be my favorite bug type Pokemon, but my favorite bug type Pokemon is Scizor. It will always be Scizor. You know why? Because he's super heckin' cool. That's why. I really love Scizor. Like, probably by the time this goes up, there's gonna be a picture of Scizor on my laptop. Because, yeah, I really love Scizor. Anyways, Tibbles is gonna wipe away the Magmar with Hydro Pump in it. He's gonna go down just like that. Good job, Tibbles. Really good job, Tibbles. Good job, Pizza Hut. <laughs> hey, take it easy. Hey, I'm walking here. Oh my god, did you turn him into a Pokemon? Did you hear that? Gary turned Bill into a Pokemon. Oh my goodness, someone call the police. Oh, there they are right there. <laughs> uh... I'm glad to see he still has his Magmar. Wish I could say the same. Rip. Rip a dip. Have you heard about Bill? Bill, Bill, the PC guy. No. He's gotta have a last name. That's the question of the day. What is Bill's last name? Because my dad's name. He, no, wait, no. He goes by Bill. But his name is William. Dun, dun, dun. Oh. This is the Nugget Bridge. Beat us five traders and will a fabulous prize. Think you got what it takes? Maybe. Hopefully. Bring it a strainer. Oh, bring it a little less. <laughs> Because Vaporeon is absolutely broken in this game. Man. No. My favorite e evolution has to be Jolteon. I love Jolteon. You know why? Because he's cool. Well, I mean, favorite in regards to Generation 1. Counting all the generations, my favorite Eevee Pokemon would have to be... I really like... Leafeon? I really do. He's a precious cupcake that can't do anything wrong. Except this Vaporeon is really mashing my potatoes right now. Come on, Buzz Lightyear. Oh, do you, do you think I can finish with a quick attack? Yay! There we go. Wiggly tough. He's just got all the power. I don't mess with Wiggly Tuffs, man. They got that crazy look in their eyes. And Jigglypuff just looks absolutely nuts. Nuts, I tell you. Nuts. Drives me bonkers.
I just realized he had like two of the most bulky Pokemon in the game. Well, not the whole game, like... Like, in regards to Gen 1. You know what, I'm gonna teach... I'm gonna teach Double Kick to King. Because... It'll give him more coverage, it's better than Takedown, it's better than Roar. To be honest. <laughs> okay. And now he can be our front man because Tibbles is level 18. Buzz Lightyear, but by Lightyear, Buzz Lightyear just overtook King in levels, and I feel like I've been neglecting my doggo. King, but <laughs> oh shit! No, no! Oh, oh my goodness! No, this is too stressful. This is too stressful. My stress levels have hit the max. Uh uh, no, no, not in my house. Ah, no! Hits me with another Dragon Rage, I'm fucking dead. Um, 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 oh god, someone's gonna die here. Someone's gonna die here. I can't lose Tibbles. I can't lose Tibbles. No, no. I can't lose Tibbles. Okay, I can heal stall. Alright. Okay, now I can hit him with the Dragon Rage because I outspeed and I can outspeed him again. Oh god. No. Oh my goodness. It's like, what if he had another one? Meowth? Oh, okay. We take those. We take those. Oh, man. Oh, ho, ho. He's getting way too real in Pokemon right now. Oh, wow. Oh, man. Yeah, I wish that was the boss. Time to go to the Pokemon Center. <laughs> I'm almost tempted to like always lead with Buzz Lightyear because if another Gyarados pops up and I throw in Buzz Lightyear, he's low on HP on accident, and then he Dragon Rages my ass. Oh no, I would be sad. Uh oh. Um, you ever get that fear, that feeling when you're wearing headphones, and it just doesn't feel right? So then you like take it out and you put it back in in hopes it'd make it feel better, but it doesn't. Yeah, I just had that. I'm not a big fan of that feeling. Uh. Drowsy. Drowsy. I don't know, Ember. I can't imagine Drowsy having the best special stat of all time. Maybe hit him with takedown. There we go. Pharaoh. The Pharaoh. You know, they should have called him Pharaoh. And they should have given him, like, Egyptian roots. And made him, like, ground flying. 
if they have a Pokemon region in Egypt and like a lo like you know how Lolan forms, they'd have like I don't know Egyptica forms, and Fero would be the Pharaoh, and it would be awesome. And it would be great, and they'd have a new type called Light type and Space type. It would be great. Hire me, Nintendo. <laughs> Yeah, the next uh, Pokemon game to come out is Pokemon Ultra Moon and Ultra Sun. But to be honest, there's just something about Pokemon Sun and Moon that rubbed me kind of the wrong way. I bet it was like the con the not confusion, the um, the cutscenes. The cutscenes really like threw off the pace of the game and how it's like oh. You have to go here. But I understand that because, like, little kids are playing this game too. And they don't want them to get, like, lost. You know what I mean? Yeah, because, like, have you seen a little kid try to play Pokemon Blue for the first time? Like, blows their heckin' minds. It's like, oh god, how do I get over there? It's like, they don't know how to play these games. They don't want to play these games because they are hard. Alright, so we're battling another boss. Boss battle. Dodrio. Mm, I think we can take him. Hit him with a double kick. Oh! Oh, it happened! The hacks are with... Oh, no. Okay. Well, that's doing a lot. That was three times. That was like 18 damage. I bet take down. Take it down. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oddish. Oh my god, it's so dark. Here, let me light that up. No. You're not going to get any love through that, Oddish. You can't just leech off King's big heart, you idiot. Do, 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 Give me a potion. I just want it above... 40 in case we get hit with that bull Ah, that's not what I wanted to do. No. Wait, yeah. Alright, here we go. Okay, I'm number five. I'll stomp you. Will you? Will you stomp me? Are you gonna make me flinch? I do not have a ground type for you. And you are not steel in this generation. Tibbles would be suicide. Buzz Lightyear would not. Uh, quick attack? I can't really quick attack a Magneton to death. I mean, I could. It would take a while. Because I think Magneton's got like a decent defense, I want to say, in this generation. Because he doesn't have steel typing. And we got the burn! Oh yeah! Ow! Wow, that kind of heckin' hurt. Oh, my leg. Oh, thank God. I just got a free heal. <laughs> Alright, let's... Let's hit him. Because Ember did, like, nothing. Double kick. You're doing... You're doing alright. Oh, God. Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. E... Woo! 
Oh no. No! Oh, paralyzed! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Are you trying to give me a heart attack, Ghost Rider? God dang. Uh-uh. I'm going straight to the Pokemon Center. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Welcome to our Pokemon Center. We hear your Pokemon back to perfect tales. Okay, what do you your Pokemon? <laughs> Thank you, your Pokemon are inviting fit. We hope to see you again. Thanks, Nurse Joy. Oh, let me get to Bill. Bill, 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 Bill. Where's my nugget? You got my nugget? Hey. Hey. Huh? Dedicated to evil? I didn't even answer. Oh, okay. Now, I know everybody, literally in the history of anyone that has played Pokemon, said they should make a game where you play as the evil team. And I don't agree with that, <laughs> to be honest. Because the main reason for a Pokemon game is you're the good guy and you're taking down the bad guy unless oh here we go unless you like start in the evil team and you're like in their whole like system and then you're like a you're you have like a change of heart and then they like freaking murder no 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 ignore that and then you take down the organization within the organization and instead of like gyms they'll have like bosses that you need to beat and you'll gain like companion oh dude that'd be neat that'd be hire me nintendo come on i'll submit a job application so you can hit me up like the next month you know just like home depot did oh yeah i'm currently in I'm almost working at Home Depot <laughs> like they're just gonna do their background check and I'm gonna be pushing carts at the Home Depot and y'all can come see me you can be like hey I know that guy he makes awesome YouTube videos and I'll be like hell yeah it'll be fun it'll be a fun time Boo, boo, boo. You're not a doctor. Yeah, I know. Get get out of my face. You you fake pediatrician, you. Oh boy, another TM. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Oh, bubble. <laughs> I can teach you the tibbles. He needs, like... A not hydro pumpy water move. And he will forget Leer. Could you just imagine a big ass Gyarados blowing bubbles? That image is just too pure for words. And apparently, we're gonna get an encounter on this route. Hell yeah, what's it gonna be? Oh my goodness. Are you serious right now? I think I'm gonna scream. I don't know if I can catch this thing to be honest, but you know what? We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it right here. Live coming from, oh shit that moves broken in this game no it stop 
Is stop. I swear to God, Pizza Hut, if you get, if you freaking kill this Moltres, I'm releasing you. I hope you know that's what's gonna happen. That's what you have at stake, Pizza Hut. That's what you have at stake. Oh my goodness. Oh my, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, someone's gonna die. Someone's gonna die. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna start bombarding Pokeballs, because this is too much for me. This is just too much. This is just too much. This is too much, my man. Too much. How many Pokeballs? I got 12. Let's go. First one. Oh, dang it. Come on, Moltres, please. 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 One, two. Oh. Please. Please, Moltres. Ooh. One, two. Oh. It appeared to be uncaught. Oh. <gasps> One, two, three. Oh my goodness! Yay! <laughs> oh my god, we got a Moltres. Oh. Oh. That's pretty red. What are we gonna name this fantastic beast? We're gonna name well okay. Molt Trace. Molten Three. I just know the name. I know the perfect I know the perfect name. Heck yeah. Oh my goodness. I think that's gonna I think I think I've had enough heartache. That's going to do it for today. If you liked the video, thanks for watching. Uh -huh. Bye! <gasps>